Everyone called Board of Canvas to order. That body made it official today. And the final official tally, Marionette Miller Meeks defeated Rita Hart by a margin of six votes. The second district race was one of the closest congressional contests in U.S. history. A district-wide recount shaved the margin from 47 votes to just six. I think that, that race alone reinforces that every vote counts and can make a difference. But the unanimous certification vote may not end the battle between Hart, a Democrat, and Miller Meeks, a Republican, to represent the district in the U.S. House. Hart's campaign has hinted at a court challenge. In a statement Monday promising to outline next steps in the coming days, Hart's campaign manager said, quote, under Iowa law, this recount process was designed to count ballots that had already been tallied, meaning that additional legal ballots may have yet to be counted. Here's how a challenge would work. Under Iowa law, a campaign can challenge certification within two days. That would trigger the formation of a contest court comprised of Iowa Chief Justice Susan Christensen and four district judges. The panel would be expected to rule on which candidate is entitled to the seat by December 8th. If Hart loses, she could appeal to the Democratic-controlled House, which has the power to judge its members' elections and has intervened on rare occasions. Miller Meeks continues to express confidence in her win, though, tweeting Monday, let's get to work.